ப்ராஜெக்ட் கோட் ஐடி ஐஓடி ஜீரோ எயிட் ப்ராஜெக்ட் டைட்டில் சூப்பர் மார்க்கெட் ஷாப்பிங் கார்ட் சிஸ்டம் யூசிங் ஐஓடி அண்டு ஆர்எஃப்ஐ டெக்னாலஜி ஸோ மெயின் தீம் ஆஃப் த ப்ராஜெக்ட் இஸ் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டெவலப் இயர் ஸ்மார்ட் ஷாப்பிங் ஸ்மார்ட் கார்ட் ஃபார் ஷாப்பிங் ஸோ இன் ரியல் டைம் சினாரியோ தட் இஸ் எ லாங் கியூ ஃபார் payment so the long queue is waiting for payment and then uh, scanning of each scanning of each product is scanning of each product time consumption time consumption so this is the drawbacks in the system this one is all come to using a proposed method in proposed method so we are going to develop a arduino based system so which is going to uh, monitor each item using rfid technology such so as players in the shopping cart so existing concept in existing existing method so you may need to uh, manually purchase manually payment and then in counter section time consumes hi so this is a existing concept and then on drawbacks so manual scanning scanning of each product and then payment takes i payment is more difficult this is a drawback in this system in proposed system so we are using rfid technology to scan the product and then total amount is displayed in server for each card so this system is operated automatically and then easy of payment so and then this one is cloud based system and the main advantage is less time so this is a block diagram here we are using one controller so arduino here you no know. this is a card section so here the inputs are rfid reader so this we are using for two cards and then rfid tags and then pressure sensor for object placement this is the inputs and then toggle switch whether we are going to place the object or uh, place the item or remove the item so and then outputs are lcd display so and then zigbee this is this is powered using 12 volt adapter power supply next one in payment section here we are using keep pad for entering total amount and zigbee receiver used to receive the total amount and iot model displays the each cart items and then lcd is a output so gsm sent for confirmation of payment and then components we are using 
how do you know mega like name is at mega 2560 for arduino you know 0 to at mega 3 to 8 here pin configuration 0 to 53 pins digital pins a now to a15 analog pins here pin configuration 0 to 13 digital pins and a now to a5 analog pins so both the operating voltage 5 volt dc and we are implementing using uart uart protocol for communication so next one we are using rfid reader we are using em18 model it's a passive operating voltage is plus 5 volt dc next one is gsm we are using sim 800l it's a 2g based sim method we can sms or send call so next one we are using is lcd so session column two rows this one is a column this one is a row operating voltage is plus 5 volt dc next one we are using zp Act as a both transmitter and receiver. So its baud rate is baud rate means 9600 bits per second. It's a speed or baud rate. Next one, P pair. We are using 4 cross 4 or 4 cross 3. This one is a row. This one is a column. So next one is pressure sensor. So it is used to identify the object present or not. So operating voltage is plus 5 volt DC. So next one is you know plus 5 volt DC. IC name is at mega 3 to 8. And then we are using IoT model ESP8266 version 12E. So it receives the data from Arduino using UART protocol and then data is passed to the load load server. So these are the components requirement and then software you're using is Arduino IDE for coding and then the language we are using is embedded C. And then real time application we are using in smart shopping and this is used in agriculture etc so final conclusion here we are developing a smart card for shopping to reduce the time consumption thank you